Right, basically we can now get whatever's in here. More plasma energy. Right, now what you want to do now is basically run all the way up to this corner, to this door, and run all the way back to the corner again. Basically this corner is your best friend. And that will trigger the second wave. I knew you was faking. The hell is that? Force energy. Alright. Whoa! Right, yeah. <clears throat> so wait for it to all go quiet. You'll, you'll hear like a load of bird chatter and like animals howling and shit like that in the background. When it goes quiet, it's normally safe to move. We'll do the same thing again, up to here. Wait for a few seconds. Back down here. And we seem to be okay now. Certainly there's a hell of a lot of... Ah, oh, no. No, we did trigger more. Look, there's one coming. So what is that then? Three times at least you've got to go up there. Right, I think that's got to be it now. Nope, I hear the chatter. There we go. See if he left us anything. No. Nope. Alright, so I think that's it now for enemies. <coughs> but the way to find out is to do a quick lap of the perimeter. Yeah, and by now the music would have started up again and you'd, have, you'd be hearing uh, things charging at you. Right, let's have a look at our... Right, so we're down to 50. 59 is that spare pulse rifle ammo. That's nowhere near enough, but it'll be enough for, to clear out this place. Right, so once you've done that and the room is clear, start following your little blue laser because there will be more enemies I wonder if we can take one of them in here with us always prepared to try something new take one of these in with you you notice that there's no oxygen in here that's because of these uh, heavy breathing enemies here Credits. Right, now what you want to do before you kill him, it's, uh, it's the same as before, this corner here this time. So the corner near to the heavy breather. Come on, die. Come on, what's happened? There you go. Right, so four of them. And we'll pick this up. You notice that the air is now clear. Now one's about to come out of that vent. You can hear there's a baby outside the room. And you're going to have one of those, I think it's one of those black shiny 
charges. He's going to come through there. No, he didn't die. Maybe I was a bit early. Thank you for the pulse rifle ammo. Right, now out here is where the baby's going to be. It's where your blue light tells you to go anyway. So we want to deal with the baby. Just wait here, he'll come to you eventually. Whoa! Son of a bitch! I don't think I hit him once. Right, I know he comes to you, but normally he doesn't run right at your feet. Okay, so you're okay now. Your blue light's basically just going to tell you to come round here to the next little room. And what you... Uh what you get this time <coughs> is very annoying if you've got the ripper if you have bought the ripper then the easiest way to do it is to just trigger the ripper and just wait for them to come to you you'll see what I'm talking about it's basically a fatty and it's full of babies game's going to make a liar out of me again, but I'm glad this time. Right, usually that one's full of fatties. It has been the, t the two times before that I tried to clear this room. Um, and you just have to stand here, and I just stand here with the pulse rifle and just wail on them and, and kill them all as they approach. Right, where's next? Up the lift, I think. Warning. Toxics detected in atmosphere processing. A repair technician has been notified. Right. Another thing I would point out is that the I don't think you get sent up there, but I forgot I forgot all about it. But you should always check out um, all of all three floors that the lifts go to, um, because I think but because there's another room like this later on, and the same thing happens. It only sends you to one of the floors, but if you check out the other floor, you get uh, there's a load of items lying up here. So. Give me some pulse rifle ammo, come on. Ruby Ruby semiconductor, lots of money. Yes, and another one, go on. Oh. Right, so that's all there is on the level three of this lift. So we go down to level two. It's basically, it's not always fastest. That's some money. It's not always the fastest way to do things to follow the blip, that that laser. Um, in the next room, that's like this, you should ignore the laser altogether and just do it the way I'll show you. Right, we enter a room and there's bodies lying everywhere. So. Isaac, make us whole again. So we know that there's something up when you see something like that. So obviously the first thing to do in this room is get stomping. Give me your head boy. 